Isis and the name of the sun god. Isis was a clever woman, explained one story, more intelligent than countless gods. She was ignorant of nothing in heaven or on earth. She wanted to place herself and her son, Horus, at the head of the pantheon of gods, and the only way to do this was to discover Rey's secret name. One day, Isis came upon Rey when he was asleep, snoring loudly. From the corner of his open mouth hung a long dribble of saliva, which gathered weight and fell to the ground. Isis pounced. Scooping up the spittle, she mixed it with clay in the form of a poisonous snake. Then she breathed magic into the snake to make it come alive. Isis had noticed Ray's movements, and knew that every so often he would leave his palace to go for a walk. Each time on his route, he passed a crossroads. Isis left her snake there and awaited further developments. Ray emerged for his excursion, and, as Isis had planned, the snake bit him. Ray saw nothing, but he felt the poison coursing through him. In pain, he called to the other gods for help. Ray had a fever and was sweating and shivering, but the gods were helpless. They could do no more than mourn the impending loss of the sun. Isis then made a dramatic entrance. She could cure him, she said but only if he would tell her his name. Ray refused. She offered again and again, but still he declined. Eventually his agony became so extreme that he could bear it no longer, and he agreed to give Isis the secret, on condition that she should tell it to no one other than her son, Horus. Isis accepted these terms, and speaking aloud the god's true name, she removed the poison. The sun god was cured at once, and Isis and Horus attained the power that they had sought.